guys, this is Spartan 117GW, and I have this cool gun here. This is the Elite Force Avalon OEM by VFC. Now, the Avalon is pretty much one of those guns that was uh, released this past year as a direct competitor to Crytax Supremacy. Uh, this is a fantastic gun out of the box. As you can see, I've changed a few things, just noting that when it comes out of the box, it has the VFC QRS uh, accessories. It'll have the QRS mag, it'll have sights, it'll have uh, the grip and the stock. And of course, I swapped out for PTS stuff. One, just because, you know, I love PTS stuff and I think it's fantastic. I mean, the battery, battery stock is absolutely second to none. The texture on the grip, the magazine, different muzzle devices, just my personal preference. Uh, but the bone stock, QR, um, bone stock um, VFC Avalon shoots really, really well. Now this is the caliber and shoots about 370, 380 FPS. And I was very, very surprised at its performance. First time I got my hands on it to actually game with it was a battle hack. Uh, I teamed up with the Elite Force guys when I was out there. It was PTS Elite Force Day. Uh, they let me use this gun and I was actually really surprised with the kills that I was getting. Now, I was getting some pretty good range and I was able to really clear through a lot of the debris, a lot of the trees and stuff that was in the way. And there's a lot of shots that I was getting that I was like, wow, I actually killed that guy. Um, so it was really putting them down range very, very accurately. Now I actually got to use this at Stryker Airsoft Field, which is a field in Santa Paula that Dutch goes to, and I was playing with Dutch. Um, I was getting plenty of kills and stacking those bodies really high out there. So it was interesting to see, because I had a much clearer picture of what the performance was like in that space, because it's much more open. Um, the rate of fire is very, very snappy. It's very, very clean and crisp. I really love the trigger. The trigger is absolutely fantastic. It's a straight trigger, which I've kind of become more accustomed to. I've kind of, it's really grown on me. I wasn't really a big fan how they looked before, but after using straight trigger, type rifles it's, it feels really really good um, going back to what I was saying performance wise very, very snappy very good rate of fire it's a very clean shooting gun um, you can really get a sense for the quality and you can really get a sense for the performance when you shoot this gun it just sounds and feels excellent so when you're shooting it's absolutely fantastic um, range definitely was killing people at, at least at 150 feet or more um you could probably get kills a little bit further probably more around like 200 so i'm thinking about dropping a couple upgrades in here um maybe bringing it by umbrella armory or at least putting a like a promy barrel with r hop or something in this gun just get a little more range out of it and maybe bumping it flat right up to 400 fps uh, but out of the box the gun's absolutely fantastic really quick rundown of the external configuration that i have now uh, pts flash comp in force weapon mad light bcm key mod rail covers pts forest grip uh enhanced polymer magazine srs replica ep boost backup site uh, pts uh, compact grip i got the enhanced polymer stock second to none when it comes to battery space i also got a crytac front sight now it's going to blast me to have that on there but the front side uh, front sights on crytax are pretty good so i use it as a reference point for when i'm going running and gunning but overall i'm really impressed with the performance of this gun uh the caliper in this configuration in the short version uh retails for about 350 bucks so it's kind of right there in the price point right right there going up against crytac now i need to do a one-to-one -one comparison video crytac versus avalon maybe a couple against a couple of the other comparative uh top tier guns that are for sale out there but i think this is a fantastic gun out of the box it won't break the bank and i think you guys will dig it so make sure you guys check out the elite force avalon available pretty much everywhere and while you're at it go ahead and swing a couple pts accessories on there as well because these this is pretty much how what i would recommend for this gun uh it's kind of some of my favorite pts accessories that i've chosen uh in the configuration that i like so this is how i would game it obviously because this is what i've been running lately uh but yeah if you guys like this video please comment and subscribe let me know what you guys think think about doing some video game videos as well and i'm probably gonna be putting up some more gameplay so thank you guys for watching this is spartan 117 gw i'll see you guys next time